today is the day. This, this beauty behind me. I'm finally going to attempt in refinishing it. I have never refinished, come on lady. I have never refinished any kind of furniture before. Um, I have done the cabinets in my office. Um, if you would be interested in seeing that, I'll link that above. What I plan on doing to this table, and I'm going to insert some, um, I guess, some inspiration on what I want to do with it. So I'll just put all of that right around here. And what I'm pretty much going to do um, is I do have some paint. Um, I'm going to be painting the bottom as you see in the pictures. I'm going to be staining the top and the stain that I am using is by general finishes um, It's what I use to stain the cabinets in my office um, This stuff like stretches such a long way. It's probably going to be um, more than a one-day project um, I'm just kind of excited. I wanted to get this done before Thanksgiving So we shall see I'm going to stain I think first, or I'm just gonna go ahead and sand. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna sand first. I'm gonna sand the base, and then I'm gonna sand the top, stain the top, and I'm gonna do that first. We shall see how that goes. So, let's get started. <laughs> with another coat of the white. It's been a long process. Um, because what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna sand down the edges and just to stress it a little bit and I'm gonna put a little bit of the stain that I used on top and just sort of rough it up so it's not so white. I didn't want it so white. I did want it a little distressed looking. I am a little nervous about that. <laughs> I've never done it before. I just know on these like really hard surfaces like the corners and stuff like that, I did want some of that dark stain shining through. And while that's drying, um, I'm gonna go ahead and start on the bench, which will be a lot easier than the table because it's significantly smaller. And the chairs won't be as hard because they'll be just solid white and I won't have to worry about doing separate stain and, and paint. It is 11.30 <laughs> at night. Um, did wanna check in with you guys. I have been working on this since this is day two. Tomorrow will be day three. <laughs> um, so let me get away from it because it's it's a tad bit strong. I did open windows up. Let me walk over here. I am dead tired. I have literally been working on this for the past two days. And the table and the bench are done. I just put on the top coat of the polyurethane. I'm only going to do it on the stained part. Um because I don't think the rest of it needs it. Um, tomorrow, I will be painting the chairs. I'm gonna get up early in the morning and take them all outside um, because, thank God for my husband, he went and picked me up a spray gun. <laughs> so, I did paint one chair. <laughs> I started painting one chair. I'm gonna show you what the chair looks like. I um, started painting one chair and I was like, I cannot do this for the rest of these chairs. 
my back's killing me my butt was hurting my knees are killing me like because i was you know like kneeled down i had like my knees on the floor why well, i didn't have something underneath my knees i will never know because our floors are hardwood floors and they are hard wood okay but i did want to show you the finished product of the table and the bench um the chairs will come later this is what one coat of the paint looks like it did look like that on the table but i ended up doing five coats on the table and it's just really hard to do five coats on all of this detail work so that's where the sprayer is going to come in handy but here is the table and the bench as you can see i did add some of the little detailed places sorry if you can hear the dishwasher going that little distressing was a lot harder than it looks and I looked up quite a bit of like tutorials and things on it but it was a lot harder than it looked I ended up painting over some of the spots with white paint but that's done <sighs> so yes I will be inserting some footage after this, but hope you guys have a beautiful and blessed day and thanks for watching.